Welcome back to Work Plus Gains, where we break down the hottest matchups and dive deep into the fighters who are shaping the future of boxing. Today, we're bringing you an electrifying analysis of a clash that's got the entire boxing world buzzing. Gervonta Tank Davis versus Frank the Ghost Martin. We'll break down their strengths and weaknesses, analyze their fighting styles, and predict who will come out on top in this epic showdown. So strap in and get ready for an in-depth look at what promises to be a thrilling encounter between two of boxing's finest. Let's get into it. First up, Gervonta Davis, age 28, debut February 22nd, 2013, record 29, zero KOs, 27, 93.1%, height 166 centimeters, reach 171 centimeters, Davis fights in a southpaw stance, giving him an advantage over the majority of orthodox fighters. His extended lead hand maintains distance and blocks vision, while his rear hand stays defensive. He frequently ducks his head as both a feint and defensive measure, making it hard for opponents to read him. His power and ability to observe opponents set him apart, helping him knock out 27 of his 29 opponents. Low volume, High impact Davis's knockout power comes from a low volume of punches. He conserves energy, relying on counter punching, fainting, and exploiting openings. He waits for perfect moments to unleash his power, either by luring opponents to overreach or by ducking and pushing their guard open for a powerful uppercut. Work the body, Davis targets the body to wear down opponents and lower their guard. His hard straight left to the midsection inflicts damage and drains energy, leading to powerful headshots when opponents drop their guard, often resulting in a knockout. Defensive Mastery Davis excels in defense with impressive head movement, footwork, and jab usage. His extended jab offers better vision, blocks opponents' hands, and can blind them temporarily. This allows him to counter or angle out of danger while maintaining protection. Ring control and movement. Davis controls the fight's pace and distance with footwork and lateral movement. He positions himself strategically in the corner to lure opponents into overcommitting, allowing him to counter effectively. Targeting and exploiting weaknesses. Davis's observational skills help him identify and exploit small openings in his opponent's defenses. He patiently waits for the right moment, using fakes to test and bait his opponent, then delivers a knockout blow when the opportunity arises. Frank Martin Age, 29, debut October 7, 2017, record 18-0 KOs, 12, 66.67%, height 173 centimeters, 5'8", reach 173 centimeters, 68, stance, southpaw, the basics, Frank Martin fights in a southpaw stance, which provides an advantage against orthodox fighters. His style is characterized by a strong jab that helps maintain distance and disrupt opponent's rhythm. Martin is defensively responsible, keeping his guard up and using head movement to avoid punches he frequently uses his jab not only as an offensive tool, but also to set up his powerful left hand. Low volume, high impact. Martin's knockout power is notable despite a relatively low volume of punches. He focuses on precision and timing, conserving energy to deliver impactful shots. His counter-punching strategy is central to his offense, utilizing feints to create openings and exploiting his opponent's mistakes. Martin's ability to gauge distance and time his punches allows him to land powerful blows efficiently. Work the body. Martin excels in body work, targeting his opponent's midsections to wear them down and lower their guard. His straight left to the body is particularly effective, sapping his opponent's energy and creating opportunities for headshots. This strategy often leads to his opponents dropping their guards, setting them up for powerful hooks and uppercuts. Defensive Mastery While known for his offensive capabilities, Martin's defensive skills are equally impressive. 
His head movement and footwork are key components of his defense, allowing him to avoid punches and reposition himself for counterattacks. Martin's jab plays a crucial role in his defense, helping to keep his opponents at bay and providing a buffer against incoming shots. Ring control and movement. Martin is adept at controlling the pace and distance of a fight. His lateral movement and footwork enable him to navigate the ring effectively, choosing positions that favor his fighting style. By maintaining control of the ring, Martin sets traps for his opponents, luring them into making mistakes that he can capitalize on with his precise and powerful punches. Targeting and exploiting weaknesses. Martin's keen observational skills allow him to identify and exploit his opponent's weaknesses. He patiently waits for openings using feints and subtle movements to test and bait his opponents. When he detects a vulnerability, Martin strikes decisively, often ending fights with a single, well-placed punch. Frank Martin's rise in the lightweight division showcases his blend of power precision and tactical intelligence making him a formidable opponent for any fighter in the ring comparison of Gervonta Davis and Frank Martin Gervonta Davis strengths power Davis has an impressive knockout rate of 93.1 percent with 27 KOs out of 29 wins his power is a significant advantage often ending fights early Defense, Davis's head movement, footwork, and use of his jab for defense make him difficult to hit. He frequently ducks and angles out of danger while keeping his hands up for protection. Ring IQ. His ability to observe and adapt to his opponents allows him to exploit their weaknesses effectively. He sets up traps and counters with precise timing. Body work, Davis targets the body to lower his opponent's guard, setting up powerful headshots that often lead to knockouts. Weaknesses, low volume, Davis tends to throw fewer punches relying on power and precision. This can be a disadvantage in fights that go the distance if he doesn't land enough significant shots. Risk of over-reliance on power. Over-relying on his power could backfire if he faces an opponent with a strong chin and excellent defensive skills. Frank Martin's strengths. Defense. Martin's defensive responsibility is a hallmark of his style. His head movement, footwork, and jab are all used to maintain a strong defense. Counterpunching. Martin excels in counterpunching, using feints and precise timing to exploit openings in his opponent's defenses. Body work like Davis, Martin effectively targets the body to wear down his opponents and create openings for headshots. Ring control. Martin's ability to control the pace and distance of the fight through his footwork and movement is a significant strength. Weaknesses, power. While Martin has a solid knockout rate of 66.67%, it is lower than Davis's which could be a disadvantage in a power exchange experience. With fewer fights and knockouts than Davis, Martin may lack experience in high-stakes bouts against top-tier opponents. Why the better fighter will win. Gervonta Davis, Davis's overwhelming power and knockout ability give him a significant edge. His experience in high-profile fights and his ability to adapt and exploit weaknesses make him a formidable opponent. Davis's superior knockout rate suggests that he can end the fight with a single punch, making him highly dangerous throughout the bout. Frank Martin, Martin's strong defensive skills and counterpunching ability could neutralize Davis's power. If Martin can maintain his defensive discipline and control the ring's pace, he could frustrate Davis and avoid the powerful shots. His strategic bodywork could wear Davis down over the rounds. Prediction, while both fighters have significant strengths, Gervonta Davis's proven knockout power and experience against top-tier opponents likely give him the edge in this matchup. His ability to end fights early with a single punch means that Martin will need to be perfect defensively throughout the bout. If Davis can break through Martin's defense, he stands a good chance of securing a victory, potentially by knockout. However, if Martin can effectively use his defensive skills and counterpunching to avoid Davis's power shots and control the fight's pace, he could win on points. 
Stay tuned for future videos. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And let me know in the comments who you think will win this fight.